Critics of Green Bay Mayor Jim Schmidt upset over their two month delay in a criminal case charging him with campaign finance violations. Tonight, one Brown County leader is pushing a proposal that he says would keep corruption out of local government. Mayor Jim Schmidt tells NBC 26 he'd rather his plea and sentencing hearing be resolved now than pushed back to December 5th. It's a sentiment echoed by Alderman Guy Zima in court Wednesday as the mayor's attorney entered a not guilty plea on Schmidt's behalf. But one way or another, there's a number of us that are going to seek justice. Zima still upset over a plea deal reducing Schmidt's charges, including tampering with financial records to three misdemeanors. These are not unintentional mistakes as he claims. They're intentional in every shape and form and manner. I think we can be leaders here in Brown County. We can move forward with good government and transparency. On the county level, Supervisor Stosh Grzynski is introducing a proposal that would change the way candidates submit campaign finance reports. The proposal would ask supervisors to also put in a copy of their bank statement with that. So we'd want to cover the scope of contributions that a candidate would receive throughout that time. As it stands, the proposal would only impact county elections, but its author hopes it would have a ripple effect. Whether you have candidates looking into other candidates' bank accounts or candidates that are reporting different numbers on their finance reports, there's a lot of different things we can do. Hoping to keep government Government clean. Attorneys say the plea deal will help Mayor Schmidt avoid jail time. Schmidt must also donate $26,000 in his election account to the school fund.